All right, guys, this is our Vauxhall Astra that we're in right now. And as you may see there, we do have the engine warning light on. Um, now, to try and diagnose what the fault is, we're going to use this iCarsoft i902 multi system scan tool. It, it will scan um, sort of most of the systems within your Vauxhall or Opel vehicle. Um, but first of all, what we'll do is we'll uh, obviously we've hooked it up to the diagnostic port as you can see here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go through the diagnostic menu and see if we can find out what the problem is and why the engine light is on. So we're in a 2000 model here. That's an Astra G. It's a 1.6 engine, so it's 1.6. We've got manual select. You can actually go and diagnose all of the systems just cl by clicking automatic. So if you're not sure where a fault may lie, um, it will automatically find it for you. Uh, but the engine module is the X16 XEL, depending on which option you chose earlier. And we're going to see if we can go in and read the DTC, which is Diagnostic Trouble Code. Alright, so as you can see there, we have code P01. 05002 and it gives us a bit of information to see that the map sensor has a low voltage okay so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and uh, take a look at that at, uh, a bit closer and then we'll come back and see if we can get the engine light cleared all right so we've put a new map sensor um, into this Astro G, it was quite easy to do. The engine light is still on, so what we need to do is we need to go ahead and connect it all up, and then what we'll do is we'll come back and you should see the engine light disappearing. So this is where we're connecting the map sensor. It's connected up there now. You'll see is the engine light you just seen it disappear there so what we can now do is go in and see if we can erase the trouble codes we should be able to clear this code now there we go erasing trouble codes succeed so we can just go back in read trouble codes and there we have it no DTCs um, so that's just a quick uh, way of using the iCarsoft i902 to diagnose any engine warning light